Aloha everyone, this is Max with Asian Geek Squad. In this video, we're going to focus on tips to extend the battery life of your Samsung Galaxy Watch Active. First tip, decrease the brightness. The default of the brightness on this watch is at 7. If you don't go outdoors too often, you could even lower this to 4 and it'll be visible indoors. Next tip is lower the screen timeout to 10 seconds, which is the lowest number. If you scroll down and go ahead and head to battery and scroll down to screen timeout, the default is 15 seconds. You can even lower it to 10 seconds. Next up, turn off wake up gesture. Go ahead and head to your settings again. Scroll down to wake up gesture and go ahead and turn this off. What this means is when you flick your wrist to look at your watch, the screen will not turn on. You can manually turn the watch on by double tapping on it or pressing the home or back button. Next step, turn off NFC. And I only recommend this if you're not using Samsung Pay. If you use other methods like Google Pay, you actually cannot use it on your watch. The only method of payment you can use on your watch is Samsung Pay. So to turn this off, go ahead and head to settings, tap on connections, tap on NFC, and toggle it to off. Now the next tip I have for you, the easiest way to do this is from your phone, is to reduce the number of notifications. So go ahead and open your Samsung Galaxy wearable application and go ahead and tap on notifications. Tap on manage notifications and turn off all of the ones you're not using. You can go ahead and turn off email and just really leave on the important ones. Reducing the number of notifications will increase your battery life. Now, if you want to really extend the battery, you can turn on power saving mode. Go ahead and go into settings. Scroll down to battery. And you can turn on power saving mode. It'll tell you the home screen will be changed to grayscale. Performance will be limited. Wi-Fi will be turned off and all functions except calls, messages, and notifications will be turned off. If you are in power saving mode, you will still get a notification, however, it does not vibrate or alert you. You'll just turn on the screen by pushing the home button, and you will not be able to respond to messages. However, this is a good way to extending your battery life in case you really need it. And just in case you enter power saving mode, to disable it, just tap on the turn off button from the home screen. Alright guys, that's a few tips and tricks for extending your battery life for the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active. If you have your own, leave us a comment down below and share it with everyone. Thank you guys for watching.